So let's talk about the future of work and corporate culture in general. I think that Jellyfish has a very innovative and disruptive way of looking at structure and organization, the way the teams are set up and everything. Can you talk a little bit about the vision and how that comes through reality, in fact? We don't want to kind of replicate existing industry structures. And so we don't, you know, get everything right straight away, but we've just got a, you know, uh, a kind of curious, innovative mindset where we want to when we want to experiment. And I think when it comes down to, to structure, um, there's a lot of sort of words to describe different company structures these days, you know, flat structures, matrix structures, hierarchical structures. We call uh, the jellyfish structure a community structure. Mm. It's based on organizing groups of people around a particular clear initiative and objective with clear roles and responsibilities on a number of different levels. Uh, so when you join Jellyfish, there is a community built around you as an individual and that is a community that thinks about you, your personal development, so includes your, you know, your mentor, the kind of capability experts that you want to, to learn from. We've been talking about the great resignation ad nauseum, right? And so how do we move from the great resignation to the great retention and how do you think of recruiting interesting talent and keeping and nurturing and growing yeah. that talent. We have a program called the Jellyfish Academy and you know that's a way for us to bring new talent into the industry. You know you've got to 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 obviously focus on you know established experienced talent there's a there's a role for that and you've got to get your story straight uh, in terms of how you how you how you attract those guys. But actually what's really important for us is to bring new talent into the industry. So, you know, when, when you talk about, you know, diversity, it's like social diversity, it's neural diversity. There are so many different types. But what we're really saying is we want different perspectives. We're trying to look in places where you don't often look for the same types of people because it improves our product. You know, people from different, uh, with different perspectives, you know, make a, a stronger creative product. So just from a purely business commercial perspective, there's a really good reason for us to be investing yeah. in that.